Welcome back to Game Therapy. I'm Brooks Gibbs with Mayana and Brayden. And we're gonna, since you're a princess, mm -hmm. this is one of your jobs, and you're a Disney fanatic, and yeah. you did very good. We're gonna play a game I call Angry Villains. I just built this game. And I noticed that a lot of villains have temper tantrums. <laughs> and, and we don't always understand why they're so angry. And so, why are they so angry? Why don't you spin the wheel, Mayana? You go first. All right. And uh, we'll see how many points this is for. Okay. There we go. 25. 25 <laughs> points. Okay. Why was Ursula angry? Because King Titran uh, banished her. I don't know if I said that right. Triton. Triton. There Sorry. you go. Okay. Close. I spelled it. Triton. Uh, she wanted feet or she wanted to be married. What do you think? King Triton did indeed banish her. Let's see what it is. Right. There okay, we go. So it's still your turn. Okay. So I go again? So, yeah, still your turn. All right. Let's go. Go ahead. Yeah. Hopefully more than 25. Oh, 100. Oh. There we For go. 100 points. Why was Gaston so angry? He broke his hairbrush. Mm -hmm. uh, he wanted to fly, or Belle didn't love him. Belle did not love him. Oh, man. This is pretty good. These are... Do you know these, by the way? Do you think you'd do just I'm as well? I'm not even given a chance to know them. All right, spin the wheel again, this time for 125 points. Okay. Uh, no, 75 points, you have 125 <laughs> so far. Why was Mother Gothel, is it Gothel? Yes, Mother Gothel. Mother Gothel, angry with Rapunzel. Ugh, she's wicked. I know, uh, she very, she is, for or, sure. Be, was she mad because Rapunzel was blonde, mm. or because Rapunzel was a bad cook, or because Rapunzel uh, escaped? It was because she was escaped. See? It was escaped, there okay, we go. that's right. There we well go. Well done, all right. And notice that uh, her demand was you must not escape. Yes. You know, so we gotta always find the demand. Oh, all I'm right. gonna spin this one for you. Gotcha, uh, it's <laughs> right. good for me. Oh, 250. 250 points. Why was Governor Ratcliffe angry with Pocahontas and all her people? Was it because they did not dress properly? Mm -hmm. Was it because he wanted gold from their land? Mm -hmm. Or was, uh, did Pocahontas remind him of her, you know, his mother? I'm gonna say he wanted gold from their land. That's right, okay. incredible. You don't even have a chance. I'm so sorry. Right. No, it's fine. Mayana, the princess is winning. I'll let you spin this time. You're okay. too smart, yep. Mayana. Okay, for 50 mm. points. Why was Ma oh. Maleficent? Maleficent, yes. Maleficent, why was she so angry? Ooh. She lost her wings, her horns, or whatever her hat was, was yeah. too heavy, or she lost her voice. Honestly, I did not know a lot about Maleficent. I think I'm gonna go, she lost her voice. Let's see if she lost her voice. Oh. Ooh. 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 Well, unfortunately, we're gonna try again, but. Um, Different question? I know, same question, oh. worth 50 points, uh, but the points get transferred actually okay. to Brayden. Ugh. What do you know? This is, what do you think, Brayden? We know it's not she lost her voice. Hmm. I'm gonna go with she lost her wings. She lost her wings, yeah, let's see what it says. It doesn't make sense. <laughs> uh, I think it just spinned for some reason. I don't know why it spinned. But you're right, Brayden, good job. Absolutely. All right, now for 500 points, why oh. was Lady Tremaine angry with Cinderella? She envied Cinderella's bank baking skills, like she env she wanted to be a good baker. Uh, she envied her charm and beauty, Cinderella's charm and beauty. Or uh, she thought Cinderella took up too much space. What do you think? I don't know. Lady Tremaine was pretty nasty, so all of them could be true. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna go with. She envied her charm and beauty. Let's see what the answer is. Oh. Ah, good job! Wow. Well, wow. now we have a consequence. Either uh -oh. uh, Mayana has to drink a, a mysterious potion. Oh. Oh gosh. Yeah. Or she's got to sing Not a song from Disney, <laughs> or she's got to dance. Hmm. Disney dance, what do you think? Are you thirsty, Mayana? <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, here, I'm gonna bring some ingredients. That's I literally used we'll to go into like, I don't public, like when I used to eat food and they had to have the soda dispensers, I would do like four parts. I would do Mountain Dew, no, right, yeah. Dr. Pepper, Coke, and Sprite. And <laughs> swirl it up, two ice cubes in there, and oh. I don't know what it was called, <laughs> but it probably was not good for me. <laughs> probably okay. not. Okay, here's the ingredients. We got sweet tea, we've got syrup. Of course, we should top it off if there's any left in there. Or start it off. Or start oh, it off. Oh, like so much. Yeah. Uh, we got some creamer, Coke Zero, my favorite, and then uh, Mountain Dew. Mm. Uh, and you don't have to drink the whole thing, just, oh. just, just like a champ. I'm gonna this take it like a champ. Don't hold back. So we're going on the bottom. <laughs> so this is just a lot of the CO2 I'm amount. getting in the drink. <laughs> yeah. It's 
we're gonna go with whatever this is. Not, not too much. That's pretty potent stuff, I gotta say. Dumps just just, just a little dabble do. <laughs> oh gosh. I wanna start with all the nice ones, the best ones. You should do a little bottom. drizzle around the room. <laughs> you are a barista. Look I at think, that. Yeah. Around the side. Okay. Yes. With drizzle. Oh wow. That's beautiful. I didn't know maple syrup would be in such a nice drizzle. Sweet tea. <laughs> Yum. Yeah. Yeah. Are we gonna mix this up or oh <laughs> I'm not liking that color. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. Oh. Mountain Dew. Okay. Oh, yeah. that's, it's just... A middle school uh, drug. Mm. And then why not a little bit of Coke? Zero. Yep. Favorite. What if you ruin Coke for me? Oh. Oh, just a little dab. <laughs> is that there it you go. for me? Okay. That okay, is. so let's do a little. But describe the smell. It smells like a fog machine. <laughs> Doesn't it You're smell right. like a fog machine? Like, like maple syrup ma and then yeah. like musk. <laughs> it's it's right. Hall Halloween in a cup. I'm gonna do a little swirl because I want to get all the flavors in there. Incredible. Let's go. <laughs> am I a genius mm. or am I a genius? Is that good? Actually, it's. Let's get a little bit of maple syrup on the side. Did you just do foam or was that liquid? Oh, oh, <laughs> she's got. <laughs> Clearly, I did something. You did not do something good, but <laughs> you did something. <laughs> That's good, ladies and gentlemen. Ugh. Well done, Mayanna. So sorry about that consequence. It's Brayden, all good. You are so cruel. But she did make you dance, you know, yeah. earlier. So. We're even. Hey, back. <laughs> Whoa. Hey, uh, we'll be right back. Hey, yo, check it with the feelings. Trying to stay calm, but my shoes up to the ceiling. Trying to beat, beat, slap, and let them tap it. Feet, feet, clap, tap it, beat. The game therapy. Therapy, therapy. Thank you for watching Game Therapy with Brooks Gibbs. If you want to see more videos like this, please like, comment, and subscribe.